Hello everybody, Steve here and today I have a couple things for you guys today. Uh, first of all I have this lock which is called the Cursed Master Lock Number 1 and I also have some lock sport mail to open up. So uh, <clears throat> first of all to start with this uh, get a good look at this so uh, if you guys recall a few weeks ago um, on picking time with Lady Locks and Lockheed uh, I was watching that and they did a draw to see who can get a chance to pick this uh, cursed master lock and I was chosen so Lady Locks sent this to me and over the you know I tried it the first time and didn't get it and over the last few weeks I've been trying off and on when I had time to try and get it and I just couldn't get very far of course you know the biggest you know I'd get in there and it seems like everything was setting right and <clears throat> then it would just kind of act kind of weird and going back and forth and I would do it when I would release tension and I could hear pins drop it sounded sometimes like five or six pins drop and so it was really kind of crazy and not not actually working out for me and <clears throat> so finally after working with it and messing with it forever you know I kind of had an idea of kind of what was going on in there but wasn't quite sure so I sent an email to Lady Locks yesterday and she to tell her kind of how things were going and stuff and then so she sent me a picture of the key because she did not send the key with this <laughs> that's part of the challenge was is to pick it without the key so she sent me a picture of the key and as soon as I just got a glimpse of the key I knew exactly what was going on and knew what needed to be done so I picked it up earlier today and just picked through it really quick so let's uh, go through it again right now and get zoomed in there it is and it is a master lock number one this would be SS for uh, <coughs> stain, or stainless steel is that what this stands for I think anyway so just use my Z bar tension wrench like I use for most master locks and then I will use this Jimmy Long's short hook with a flat tip give it some some tension and I'll go in here number one doesn't really seem like it does anything so I'll go to number two get a click out of that okay go with the number three get a click out of that okay go to number four get a good click out of that and then I'll use switch to my medium hook with the flat with a round tip this time and get on pin number one and way up there keep going way way up there and there we go that's what it take and because of that let's try something different today Yay! <laughs> Celebrate that one. Alright. Well there's our celebration for today. We got that cur that we've gotten through this cursed number one and I am not gonna show the picture of the key, so that will probably be part of the challenge for the next person. But the curse, like uh, Lady Locks responded to me when I told her earlier today, after I got it open and sent her a picture and stuff to prove it, she gave me congratulations and said the curse was lifted, so I agree with that. <laughs> and without further ado, um, we have some lock sport mail. So let's get this open. Yeah. 
This blade, this uh, knife needs to be sharpened. Plus, I'm getting it on the serrated part. <clears throat> this is my my uh, what do you call that? The uh, um, just a cheap a cheap cheap knife I got when I was visiting Mount Rushmore a few years ago. It has my name on it. It's what you call the um, I think tourist. It's a tourist uh, knife. <laughs> Here we go, and ta-da, we got new stickers from Lockchuck. This is the one with his blue belt on there, and I know he's doing a very well right now, and there's his sticker, and we also got poker chip from him. This is his newer design. So his older one is over here. Oh, wait a minute, where is it? Did I have one? I, did, I thought I had one. Oh, I didn't have one. No, I don't have one yet. So that That can be added to my collection of poker chips too, which is awesome to have. And then I can add new sticker versus page. There it is. So we have that one already. So we can Put the new sticker in there. It's awesome. Got it in our book now. Looks really good. Then we can add this. Might add this one to the to the mat here. Maybe somewhere. I think I might. Have. I don't know where he wants to be at. Does he want to be up there or over here? How about right there? Let's do this real quick. Sorry I'm rambling on. This two thing is kind of exciting to get this. I just cut my fingernails earlier today. And there we go. Lock check. Hanging out by Irish lock picker. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. Thank you Lady Locks for sending me on to this cursed master lock. And it is picked and opened. And lock check, thank you for the new sticker for the poker chip. The new stickers that put the book back over here already. Now I don't even know where it went. Where'd it go? There it is. The new sticker. So, anyway, thank you very much, everybody, for watching. Make sure that. Uh, you are subscribed and you leave comments down below and, <clears throat> and give a thumbs up, give a like. Thank you very much for watching and have a wonderful day.